Christine Brown is starting to open up about the beginning of her relationship with her husband, David Woolley. In the latest Sister Wives preview, Brown shares with her children details about how she and David first said, I love you. After sharing the details, Christine's kids seem to be shocked. First, I love you. Sister Wives is in the 19th season. In the most recent episode preview, Christine Brown sits down with her kids Peyton, 26, Aspine, 29, Mikelty, 28, Gwendolyn, 23, Isabel, 21, and Truly, 14 to discuss details about the beginning of her and her husband David Woolley's relationship. Christine shared that they took a week to say those magical words. Brown explained, he did say it first, I said it right after though. The kids appeared to be shocked by this admission. In his confessional interview, Peyton explained, I want mom to be happy, I want mom to be safe, and I'm holding judgment until I meet him. He continued, but from what I've seen and heard, she's happy, and I think she'll be okay. The kids seem to just want their mom to be happy. Christine Brown married her husband David Woolley in October 2023. She shared that she is very in love with her husband. David treats me like a queen and tells me I'm beautiful every day. I've never been in love like this before, and the world seems like a brighter place with him in it. I'm so excited for the wonderful adventure we are going to embark on for the rest of our lives. Christine Brown described the day she and David Woolley said, I love you. We sat down, I went through and met his family, and then we sat down off to the side, and he just pulled my chair next to him. He pulled me into him, and we just cuddled. She continued, I just thought, everything is crazy all around us, but right here we're going to be calm, and I legit felt calm for the first time in my life. She explained her heart was racing, and I just realized I loved him then, and I would do this for the rest of my life, she continues. It was the most amazing memory, experience, and then our souls just sensed up, and our heartbeats sensed up. I realized I was in love with him. Brown shared that the relationship with Wooly is wonderful. She describes him as kind, a good father, and a grandfather. Brown lets fans know that she never thought she would find love like this, but she is extremely happy. Good for her. It is so wonderful to see her happy and moving on with her life. What do you think of Christine and David saying I love you after only one week? Let us know in the comments. Sister Wives airs on TLC on Sundays at 10 p.m. ET. Christine Brown's life in the public eye has been nothing short of a roller coaster. As one of the four wives in the long-running TLC reality show Sister Wives, she shared the intricacies of her plural marriage to Cody Brown, offering viewers a window into her joys, challenges, and moments of profound struggle. For over a decade, Christine's life revolved around her family's unconventional dynamic, but in 2021, she made a decision that would change everything. She left Cody and their plural marriage behind. What followed was a journey of self-discovery, emotional healing, and eventually finding new love with David Woolley. Saying, I love you to David marked not just the start of a new chapter in her romantic life, but also the culmination of years of inner transformation. This declaration of love holds deep significance, not only because of what it means for Christine's future, but also for the empowerment it represents after years of emotional deprivation. This article takes an intimate look into Christine Brown's journey from plural marriage to her heartfelt first. I love you to David Woolley, exploring the emotional significance of this moment and how it symbolizes Christine's rebirth as a woman embracing her worth and desires. For over a decade, fans of Sister Wives watched as Christine navigated her role as one of four wives in Cody Brown's polygamous family. Married to Cody in 1994 as the third wife, Christine's life was centered around the idea of family first. From raising children together with her sister wives, Mary, Janelle, and later Robin, to grappling with the complications of sharing a husband, Christine often played the role of the peacemaker within the Brown family. Despite the unity the Brown family often displayed on screen, 
cracks in the foundation of their relationships became more apparent as the years went on. Christine, in particular, struggled with feelings of neglect and emotional isolation. Plural marriage, as Christine had hoped it would be, was supposed to be a partnership of mutual respect and love. But as time passed, it became clear that Christine's needs, both emotional and physical, were not being met. A pivotal moment in Christine's journey was her realization that she was no longer happy in her marriage to Cody. As the family expanded, especially with the arrival of Robin Brown in 2010 as Cody's fourth wife, Christine began to feel increasingly invisible. Robin and Cody's deepening bond left Christine feeling sidelined, and she found herself grappling with feelings of jealousy, loneliness, and inadequacy. I felt like I didn't matter, Christine admitted during one of the more emotional Sister Wives episodes. It was always about the family, but I realized that my personal happiness was never a priority. This realization marked the beginning of Christine's emotional journey toward understanding her own value and reclaiming her sense of self outside the framework of plural marriage. In Christine's plural marriage with Cody, the phrase I love you became fraught with emotional complexity. While love was supposed to be the foundation of their marriage, Christine often felt deprived of the kind of love she truly desired. For years, she experienced a lack of affection from Cody, especially as his relationship with Robin intensified. Christine's desire for deeper emotional intimacy was met with indifference from Cody, leaving her feeling emotionally starved. For Christine, saying, I love you, became an expression of yearning rather than fulfillment. She longed to hear those words from Cody, not just as a rote declaration, but as an affirmation that she mattered to him in a profound way. However, the emotional distance between them continued to grow, especially as Christine became more aware of how little her needs were being prioritized. I think at some point, I just stopped believing that love was enough to make this work, Christine reflected during one of her interviews. Love without respect, without affection, it's hollow. This emotional void carried through much of Christine's marriage, and it's what ultimately led her to leave. But beyond that, it set the stage for how important the words, I love you would become in her future relationships. When Christine finally met David Woolley, those three words carried the weight of everything she had yearned for but had never fully received. Christine's decision to leave Cody was not made overnight. It was a gradual realization that staying in the marriage was no longer serving her or allowing her to grow as an individual. After years of sacrificing her own happiness for the sake of the family, Christine made the brave choice to put herself first. The tipping point came when Christine expressed her desire to move back to Utah, where her extended family lived, after the Browns moved to Flagstaff, Arizona. Cody's rejection of this idea coupled with his increasing focus on Robin, solidified Christine's decision to leave. For Christine, moving back to Utah represented a chance to rebuild her life on her terms, away from the constraints of plural marriage. In November 2021, Christine publicly announced her separation from Cody, a move that shocked many fans of Sister Wives, but also garnered widespread support. Christine was no longer willing to live in a relationship where her emotional needs were sidelined. She was ready for something more, something real. Leaving Cody was the hardest decision I ever made, but it was also the most empowering, Christine shared in a candid Instagram post. I realized that I deserved love that was reciprocated. I deserved to be someone's priority. This bold move marked the beginning of Christine's journey toward rediscovering her self-worth, opening the door to the possibility of finding new love. In the aftermath of her separation from Cody, Christine embarked on a journey of self-love and rediscovery. No longer bound by the expectations of plural marriage, she began to focus on her own happiness, her relationship with her children, and her newfound independence. This period of self-reflection was critical for Christine, as it allowed her to redefine her identity outside of the plural family structure. 
Christine's relationship with her children, particularly her youngest daughter, truly became a focal point of her post-marriage life. The bond between Christine and truly deepened as they navigated this new chapter together, with Christine taking on the role of both mother and primary caregiver. I wanted to be a role model for my children, Christine explained. I wanted them to see that it's okay to walk away from something that isn't making you happy. It's okay to choose yourself. Christine also began to prioritize her own well-being, focusing on her health, fitness, and personal growth. Fans of Sister Wives watched as Christine embraced her independence, sharing glimpses of her new life on social media, where she radiated confidence and joy.